they're not sorry, you know, Justin. They're not in calving season yet in South Dakota, are they, Bridget? Um, not, not well. Some people might be. We've got okay. lambing going on actively. There will be some calves that are hitting the ground. It just depends on when folks um, wanted their calving season to start. So there could be some happening now. But typically, it's not that. It's it, it waits till a little later in the spring, March, April. We see a lot of. We see a lot of calving in March, but yeah. when you have weather changes like this, it's just like pregnant women. All of a sudden, a really pregnant cow <laughs> can go into, into labor and calve. I mean, if you talk to women who are labor and delivery nurses, they talk about the, the weather? weather cycles and how they use that in order to increase staffing because big changes in the pressure systems can induce labor. Well... Hmm. Uh, who would have who would have guessed that? I, <laughs> I well, had yeah, no, well. Just, there we go. Did you know? <laughs> yeah, it's a did you know, right? <laughs> happens to cattle, happens to women. The whole nine yards are having babies. So now the hospitals are going to have to subscribe <laughs> to the LRC to see when these big pattern changes are coming. There you yeah, go. Just okay, another we're not customer. Here, folks. Everybody, yeah, everybody <laughs> needs the LRC in their lives. That's why they need to listen to us every day to understand what's going on with the weather. <laughs>